What's up guys? My name is Olivia, also known as Jetlag Live, and welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's been a busy couple of months for me, but it's so good to be home for the time being. Um, later this week, we are heading to the Keys, and I am so excited. We're gonna be there for a week, kind of like a family vacation. Um, and Seth's coming too. It's gonna be a great time. And just as I'm going on Instagram, looking for like, you know, maybe I'll do some shopping, find some outfits or whatever, you know, whatever the excuse is that I was on social media. Um, and I find this ad from a company called Blow and Sons. Never heard of them. So I go and click on them and it's a luggage company. And these bags are sick. Like down to the marketing, down to the, the way they show you all that the bags can fit. I'm like, well, damn it. Now I'm hooked, right? Like, so I reached out to them and they sent me a bag to review and drum roll, please. This is how this ties into my trip. I'm going to try and purse pack the bag that they sent. If you're new on my channel, purse packing is, uh, geez, what is it like? It's like a two year old trend I've been doing on my channel, right? So we basically, you pack everything in a small personal item. It's easier for transport, it's easier for travel, it's easier on you not having to worry about this suitcase and that suitcase. Um, so it's basically a way to take away the stress of a trip. I'm not gonna need much this trip, plus we're driving a car, but there's gonna be five of us in that car. So I figured I can help everybody out, I'll purse pack. It's less for me to worry about, what do I need, like seven swimsuits and I'll, <laughs> I'll be set. Um, so I'm gonna try and purse pack. Hopefully this bag lives up to its reputation. I haven't even opened it yet. Um, it looks sick, but if it doesn't perform well, then, well, that sucks. <laughs> but I have high hopes for this bag. Let's do an unboxing and then we'll purse pack um, a little bit later. But let's open this puppy up. I'm really excited to see it like in person, like I've been like stalking it online, but I really wanna see what it looks like. So let's get into it. Let's open her up. I wanna see, I don't even remember what I like, what is getting sent to me. So this is a surprise for the both of us. Whoa, look at that. So low and sons. A note from our founders, sustainable packaging. A big goal for us is to minimize our environmental footprint and packaging is obviously an important part of that. So our first step was to try and minimize our box sizes because the smaller the box, the more carbon emission savings. Okay, it better work. 100% curbside recyclable, non-toxic, and biodegradable. Whoa. And while there, we know there's a lot more work to be done, we hope that these simple things can have a big impact on becoming a more sustainable business. Um, okay, so this is what I got. It is the Catalina Deluxe Tote in an organic canvas material. So it's organic, they're, this is a sustainable material that they're using, um, and the color is dove gray, I do remember that. So let's open her up, and that's their Instagram. I'm, I mean it guys, like if you follow them, you will see the vibey stuff that had me hooked and had me <laughs> wanting to look at every single bag they offer. Okay, so it's all packed up in here. I love that. You know that like a brand like this could easily put it in a mega box and for what? You know what I mean? And they were able to pack this so nice and neatly. Ooh! Okay. All right, let me, um... oh my God, I'm so excited. So this is it. I'm going to show you guys like firsthand. You'll see before I do. Oh my God. Wow, I'm not gonna lie, this feels like, it's not like your regular canvas tote. It's like heavy duty tote. Whoa. So obviously I'm gonna have to flatten it out a little bit, but yeah, Catalina Deluxe Tote. Organic canvas. Okay. Ooh, I'm so excited to pack this. This is, it's, okay, so according to the website, it should be um, the proper dimensions for a personal item on an airplane. You guys know I love flying budget airlines and that is the perfect dimension here 
to pass as a personal item, which is the only thing you get for free on a budget airline, typically. Holy smokes. Now, right off the bat, I feel like I have to talk about this. This thing down here, wait till y'all see this. Is it as big as I thought? Oh my God, it is. Oh, one of those silica things. So this is a shoe compartment. You guys, if you've been here a while, you know I only bring one pair of shoes when I go on those trips because they don't fit in my purse. Um, now they do. Oh my God, I cannot wait to pack that. That is going to be so awesome. Um, also, I usually only will bring like, like I have a shoe bag to put my shoes in and then I'll put them in there. I never just put the shoes right in there. Holy smokes. Okay, I'm gonna open it up, ready? Oh, we got some goodies. Okay, here we go. Oh, all right. Metal work, you better work. All right, so this is the strap. You can put it on here. I'm doing it immediately. Wow, okay. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see, but this is, this is heavy duty. Nothing about this bag is saying cheap so far, so that's a relief. Um, I know this can come off. Wow. Okay. Let me see what this looks like. <laughs> is it, oh wait, it's way too long. Oh my God, but I love, I'm looking in the mirror over here. It's freaking cute. There is, okay. A very weird smell. It smells like fresh cut grass or like sticks, like, like tree sticks. Something earthy. I don't know. It's probably has something to do with organic, but holy smokes. Okay. So this guy is pretty freaking big and I think they even have they got a side pocket here and one that zips up to secure over there. And this, I don't. I don't entirely know what this is. Oh! Is this what I think it is? Is this for the shoes? Oh my God, I think it is. Oh, it provides structure. Oh my God. Oh, oh. Whoa, it is. Look at that. Okay, so you can also probably take those out, wipe them, clean them. I think the bag is washable as well. Holy crap, that's so sick. Ah, okay. I gotta, I, gotta pack this immediately. That is a ton of room. But let me show you the bag I usually will purse pack compared to this one and we'll see like comparatively how it holds up. This is the size difference. This one's obviously a little bit bigger than this one, but I don't think anybody would say anything to me about this one. There's only one way to find out and I'm not flying anywhere yet, um, but I think this is also gonna be the perfect size for my little keys trip getaway plus listen to this this bag can double as they have it advertised as like a beach bag a gym bag um just like a day bag like a purse the options for this are insane and i am so excited to put them all to the test um but what i'm thinking of not doing if i'm flying is using the strap because any extension of the bag will probably make it look bigger and flag a flight attendant. So be careful with that. But oh my God, I'm obsessed with this color. So freaking cute. Um, aesthetically, man, this is a really thick canvas. Like it is not that cheapy. I'm looking in the mirror if, you, if you're wondering if I'm going insane or not. This is not a, a cheapy canvas at all. What does this do? Wait a minute. 
Wait a minute. Oh my god, you guys. This bag has this? That's for a suitcase. To make sure that it doesn't fall off when you're traveling. Like this is the, the handle of the suitcase and the bag stays like this and sits on the suitcase. I did not know this bag had that. I mean, or I guess I didn't remember. Okay. We've got a pocket here, a couple pockets inside. And holy crap. I'm already obsessed. Okay, let's actually put it to the test though. Is it up to my standards in regards to purse packing? Let's find out. All right, so here is the bag and we are going to purse pack this and I'm gonna lay everything out that I'm gonna bring. We can go over it. And we are going to see if it fits in this Catalina Deluxe tote. Let's do it. use a packing cube for my swimsuits just because they're gonna be loose and all over the place um, I gotta put some underwear and bras here but I'm gonna bring probably just two bras obviously enough pairs of underwear for the week and yeah so I brought three pairs of shorts I brought one two three five different like tank tops just light easy tank tops some don't need bras um, some have built-in bras was a win-win I brought like an overshirt, a couple night slash lounge clothes. Um, we'll have a washer there too, so I can always um, do, do a load of wash if I need to. I brought jeans and this sweatshirt because there's one day where it gets down to 61 and the high is like 72. And yeah, I'm a Floridian, so that's cold to me. Okay, so lay off. Thank you. Uh, no, I, I do get chilly easily. So I brought that and I'll probably wear like not a sweater, but like a sweatshirt um, on the drive down and maybe just wear a, another pair of comfy jeans or like probably leggings is probably the best bet. I brought a sundress, a cute little romper if we go out somewhere nice. Um, like I said, enough swimsuits forever. And I might throw in a couple different shirt options but i'm not sure um but let me go ahead grab a packing cube we'll get this sorted and then we'll start rolling or organizing you know what about this bag that might be different is we might be able to fold them up and stack them because of how wide this is which is super exciting so let's give it a shot So what I did was I took everything out. I'm gonna try and eliminate what I don't need. And you know, it's weird that when I stay local, like let's say a road trip, a two day trip, literally a two day trip, and I have free reign on packing anything, I will do just that. Like I will overpack to the maximum and overkill. And I don't know why it is that if I'm going to Europe for two months, I can pack one carry-on. But if I'm going on a road trip for seven days, I will pack my entire wardrobe and like three French horns. And I don't, <laughs> like I don't understand myself. Anyway, okay, so I've got my, um, my swimsuits in here. Maybe this, no, I want all these. So I'm gonna put that in here. And then let's go through jean shorts. I need those and I need these. These I don't have to have. I need jeans. I need a sweatshirt because I I just know I'm gonna get cold. Um, lounge clothes slash pajamas. Those are good. I need those. I do need this. And I gotta have these. So. Oh, plus I have all the, do I need all of the shirts?
Yeah, I do. Okay, um, let me try and finesse this here. Okay, what are the odds that this is just taking up too much space? Am I being silly? Let's try it. Do I really need these? That was an impulse. Yeah, I need them. You're gonna hear that a lot. I'm like, do I really? Yes, I do. Okay. <laughs> so let's put these suits in. They're so cute for a beach bag. I'm like just thinking of, like when I get to the place, I'm gonna unpack everything and then uh, use this as like a tote to go to the beach, go on the boat, like all the things. I'm so excited. Okay. <laughs> all right, I am doing not okay. Um, is my French horn gonna fit? That's what I wanna know. Okay. It's actually, Opens up. Ooh. Okay. Oh my God. Can I fit this? I'm I'm genuinely surprised because I did not think I was gonna be able to fit this. I literally have a bag. I have a backup bag right here because I'm like, no way. I can just wear this. That's what I'll wear and I can pack leggings in here. I so did not believe in myself this time around because I overpack for whatever reason. And it probably zips. <laughs> You're joking. Oh my God, it was this flipping out that changed the game. And look at this, and I don't even have my shoes in yet. Let me go grab a pair of sandals, just, we'll, we'll do that. I just got my, I'm bringing these Sam Edelman slip um, sandals and those Revolve Birkenstocks that I brought all over Europe. I link them, um, I can link them below too. And um, I'm repurposing the bag that the tote came in. Sustainable queen. Um, so that's cute. Let's put them in. <laughs> All right, so here we go. And why is there so much room? I don't need any other pairs of shoes. I don't plan on bringing any, but you know what I do need to bring? Some hats. Okay. So I didn't even take the tags off this yet, but look at this cute reversible bucket hat. I'm gonna bring this and this. Bucket hats are like, I think they're great sun protection because they cover your ears too on like a, like a baseball cap. Plus they're flexible, so they can go in the bottom compartment and there's still room. See what I mean? Do I need these? No, I even said it to myself and I still wanna pack them. Okay, well, they fit. Might as well. Oh my God, they fit. Okay, let's zip her up. And there is still so much room in there compared to up here. Oh my gosh. Look at this. We did it. And she still looks cute. All right guys, that is, that is the bag. That is a purse packed, keys vacation ready to happen. Honestly, I'm impressed because I absolutely, positively overpacked. I will not wear most of this. I will probably be in a swimsuit the majority of the time. <laughs> so, wow. But the fact that I've been all of that in here and shoe compartment and room. You see this? If it's not bulging like this, we've got room. So that is so exciting. Um, but yeah, I gotta pack toiletries and um, any cosmetics and stuff like that. I'll just bring in a like, just like the little purse, like a day bag. Um, I cannot believe that I did this. Wow. And this bag so far is living up to the hype that I saw on IG in the first place. So I am so glad 
to have this. Um, guys, if you're interested in shopping this Catalina Deluxe Tote um, or any of the Low & Sons luggage slash travel accessories, stuff like that, I will link not only their website, but a product link in the description too, um, so that you can do some shopping for the holidays. Now, let me tell you something. Black Friday, you might wanna get your hands on one of these puppies. I will put that in the description down below, any special deals that they're having. Um, I'll see if I can get a little upper hand and get in, get in the know and let you guys know. I'll put that in the description. So make sure you check that out. I love this bag, I can't believe it. That's all I have for you guys. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to give this video a big fat thumbs up. And again, consider subscribing because we do reviews like this all the time. We're doing travel vlogs galore and everything else in between. So I'd love to have you as part of the family. Yeah, so uh, happy holidays guys. I will see you in the next one. Bye.